If you are looking for a solution to combat green algae in your hydroponic system, then you came to the right place. Hello everyone, welcome back to Urban Food Forest. In this video, I am going to show you the safest, easiest, and most affordable tips for getting rid of green algae. So be sure to watch until the end, the last trick is a guaranteed win. So you have just transferred your seedlings into your hydroponic system, but a few days after, you notice these bright green stains on your foam cubes, your reservoir, and some are even floating in your nutrient water. These are called green algae. Green algae are tiny microscopic spores that are transported through the air. Are algae harmful to plants? Light reaching hydroponic rich water starts the growth of algae and can spread rather quickly. Now, are algae harmful to your crops? In small batches, no. But they are plant-like, they will multiply from all the love and care that you are giving your hydroponic crops from the nutrient-rich water, the right water temperature, and abundant light so they will be growing along as your crops grow. When an alga is abundantly growing in your hydroponic system, it will cause a major problem to your crops. It can cause buildup in your system, can penetrate your pump and can cling to every surface. Once they are able to invade your plant medium and your nutrient water, they will pose a major problem as they will be competing with your crops. The nutrients will be depleted as algae use them to grow, your crop's source of nutrients will become scarce, and the oxygen dissolved in the system will severely drop. Algaes also decompose as time goes which gives a bad odor, rotten green algae in your lettuce leaves? Yikes! Thankfully, there are proven ways to control algae in your system, you can do this by following these fail-proof steps. But before we head on to that, be sure to visit our website in the video description below to get access to our friendly community of growers sharing their tips and tricks, as well as participate in our fun weekly challenges. You are watching, Urban Food Forest. On with the show. A combination of sunlight and nutrients favor the growth of algae, be sure to cover every spot possible so the sunlight would not reach your nutrient water. You can do this by using opaque nutrient water reservoir, pipes, and tubing. Covering the grow medium with perlite, pebbles, or you can also be creative and use black dark cloth as a medium cover. If you notice that algae are already developing especially in the hard-to-reach areas of your hydroponic system, you may use food-safe hydrogen peroxide. Use 3 milliliters per gallon of your nutrient water and allow it to run in your system. This may be added every week to prevent algae infestation without damaging plant roots. Food-safe hydrogen peroxide will also oxygenate your plant roots. Lastly, and especially in cases of heavy algae buildup, system cleaning is the absolute best. Gently remove the net pot or the cup holding your plants. Disassemble all movable parts of your system and then follow the rinse-scrub-rinse method using a soft cleaning brush and a mixture of 1.3 ounces unscented bleach to a gallon of water. Completely dry out all parts before putting them back for a new cycle again. Be sure to use a new nutrient water mix as well. The first step towards dealing with algae is to accept that algae will be present in your system no matter what you do. What you will have to act on is to stop them from spreading. Prevention is still the key, it will save hours of cleaning and will ensure that your crops are well nourished. Let me know if this video has been helpful to you by hitting on the subscribe button, also click the bell icon to turn on notifications, and also visit our channel for more gardening tips and tricks. Happy growing!